In this video, we're going to show you how to automatically assign transactions. You can automatically assign your transactions to your spending envelopes as they come in by using the Transaction Rules Manager under the Tools menu. Then click the New button. You'll need to name the rule, and I'm going to name this Mary's Clothing Store. And then I'll need to enter some text in the Pay Contains field. The most effective rules are specific without being too specific. For example, if you only entered MA, you might end up assigning transactions you didn't mean to, like those from Bob's Market. But if you entered something like Mary CLO number 123, you might not get some transactions that you wanted, like those from other branches of Mary's clothing store. If you enter something like Mary, you should be able to get all the transactions you wanted without getting ones you didn't want. Use the drop down menu to select an action type. If you select Rename Payee 2, you can enter the text you would like the system to use when automatically renaming these transactions. If you select Assign To, you can select an envelope and the system will automatically assign your transactions to this envelope as it retrieves them. You can also click Run Now to run the rule immediately. This can save you time when it comes to assigning transactions that are always the same. For example, you may want to set up rules so that your mortgage payment always goes to your mortgage envelope. On the other hand, you probably wouldn't want to automatically assign transactions from supermarkets where you often need to split a purchase amount. When you log on, the system will show you any automatically assigned transactions in the Auto Assign Transactions Register. These transactions will appear in bold until you click on them to accept them. You can accept all your automatically assigned transactions at once by selecting Accept All. If you don't agree with the way a transaction was automatically assigned, you can drag it to your preferred envelope or you can simply undo the assignment by dragging it to the New Transactions Register. And that's how you can automatically assign your transactions.